Senator Lanham. Thank you, Madam Acting Deputy President. Today we debate the bills to cut tariffs on imports from China in line with promises made in the China-Australia Free Trade Agreement. I support these bills, but with the conclusion of this Free Trade Agreement, as well as the Trans-Pacific Partnership, the key trade issue is what should we do next? I believe that we should abolish our tariffs on imports from all countries. I believe this because free trade is fair trade. It's fair because of what the abolition of our tariffs would do for everyday Australians. There's a lot of talk about how the GST is regressive, but tariffs are far more regressive than the GST. Tariffs are imposed on products that everyday Australians use, like pasta, towels and umbrellas. And unlike the GST, tariffs apply only to goods, not services. Compared to rich people, poor people spend more of their money on goods rather than services. So even more than the GST, tariffs hit poor people harder than rich people. Free trade is fair trade. It's fair because of what the abolition of our tariffs would do to poor people overseas. Because of our tariffs, poor people in both developed and developing countries sell less of their product into Australia. By abolishing tariffs, they will sell more to us. This will boost our living standards a little and it will improve the living standards of the world's poor a lot. It will also be a sustainable boost, based not on aid and dependency, but on usefulness and self-worth. Madam Acting Deputy President, unlike the Coalition, the Liberal Democrats have specific plans and the guts to make wide-ranging cuts to government spending. So unlike the Coalition, the Liberal Democrats have the, have the credentials to make wide-ranging tax cuts. The Liberal Democrats would abolish all of our tariffs and fund this, which amounts to a tax cut, by reducing government spending. But even without spending cuts, the Coalition could abolish tariff tariffs responsibly by concurrently extending the GST to include fresh food, while still having revenue left over to provide income tax cuts. This would represent an improvement in the fairness and efficiency of the tax system. Our tariffs are a make-work exercise for customs officials. We apply tariffs on almonds, but not walnuts, maple syrup, but not golden syrup, Bis biscuits, but not crisp bread. There's a tariff on guitars and drums, but not violins and pianos, on calendars, but not diaries, on granite and sandstone <coughs> if it's in blocks, but not if it's been roughly trimmed. And there's a tariff on flat steel if it's coated with zinc, but not if it's coated with tin. The Coalition wants to retain our tariffs on products imported from overseas as long as other countries impose tariffs on products they import from us. This is akin to shooting yourself in the foot as long as the bloke next, de next door also shoots himself in the foot. The Liberal Democrats are the only free trade party in this parliament, and only the Liberal Democrats stand for true tax reform in this country. 